soon. So I'm going to start this new thing that I've never done before. It's going to be called What the Hell TV, where you guys can come on this crazy promotional journey with me for my new album, Goodbye Lullaby. And you guys can just check in daily on my website and my Facebook and see what I'm up to. So check it out. <laughs> I'm like jet lagged. I've been in my hotel for like five hours and I'm like, okay, maybe I need to go to bed, but what time is it? I'm like, what time do I need to go to bed? And I'm like, I look over the clock, it's like zero, zero, zero o'clock. What the f time is that? 1 a.m. or something? 12? 12? Minute. 12? Yeah. <laughs> you are tired. <laughs> Day one of promo here for What the Hell and my record, Goodbye Lullaby. So now they'll get on their mopeds and they'll follow up lines. You can tell because they're all there and they have their bags and their cameras and like two guys will get on one. There's a paparazzi right there. back here, paparazzi, and they're just going to follow the whole time. Yeah, I'll be like this all day. All week. Just hang, they just hang out there and see, he's looking at his pictures now. We're allowed to film him because he photographed me. <laughs> so they're all just kind of checking out their photos right now. Hey, this is Avril Lavigne, Sir NRG, hit music only. 8h27, Avril Lavigne est avec nous. Ouais Why you chantes ça? Why what the hell? <laughs> Why are you singing what the hell? It's all about saying what the hell and having fun and being spontaneous and not taking things too seriously. C'est genre on s'amuse, on se prend pas la tête, on est spontané. But when you say it, you have to say it like this. What the hell? Okay. Oh, okay. 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 What the hell? There you go. <laughs> what the hell or what the f? <laughs> ah, what the f? Uh, putain de merde. Repeat after me. Listen one, part one. Repeat the Repeat after me. La 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 la. No. 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 La France, reste avec nous, on va parler de l'album d'Avril Lavigne, il s'appelle Goodbye Lullaby et nous It's very nice to have you. Merci. Merci. Thank you very much. drove two hours to get there, it was outside of the city, and basically I kind of wanted to Abby Dawn it out, so I, with singing this, my song What the Hell, I took an Abby Dawn WTH t-shirt that had foil and just kind of cut it and put it on my dress and sewed it, so I, hopefully it looks good. <laughs> Mesdames et messieurs, un tonnerre d'applaudissements pour Avril. Basically, I went to bed at 5.30 a.m., totally sober, and woke up today at 
9.45 today. I didn't sleep very much and that's okay. Mm -hmm. I did some radio interviews. Est-ce que la pression commence à monter? Est-ce que t'es stressé? Comment tu te sens? No pressure, no stress. It's just a lot of fun. This is my fourth album. I'm really excited. And I've put a lot into this record. I wrote half of this record on my own. I produced two songs for the first time. And, and all I can really do is focus on that side. This, the part that I need to focus on is being creative. And I love music and I love to write and I love to record. I was also wondering, if, are you going to tour with this new album? Definitely. And yes. I, I, I was wondering if you still get along pretty well with your previous hits. I think it's very important to play, <laughs> if you've had a hit, to play it in concert. Um, because people are familiar with that. It's always a very exciting point. Like, complicated and skater boy, yes, they're like nine years old for me and I'm with you. But What, during an hour and a half long concert, those are the songs that are the most exciting because they were the singles, they were the hit, and people just like got really excited. So, I love playing the older stuff. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. This is officially the first time I've signed a cover. My signature has totally changed on this album. It's like... <coughs> oh. I know. I usually, like, <laughs> spell out every letter to make it really clear, like that. But I've been a little more like this. The record company are going to be like, who, who signed one this? That one. What if I just start totally doing it different like this? <laughs> <laughs> Stop it. What? It's my autograph. I can yeah, switch it up. I want all my fans to know what my signature looks like. So when they see that, they're, they're not gonna, gonna be like, that. that wasn't her. So far, it's been a really great trip. Um, I've been pretty jet lagged, so on my lunch break, I typically take a little napper. And um, it's been crazy with all the paparazzi, all the European paparazzi. So there's been lots of fans outside the hotels, and so it's nice because I get to say hello and bonjour. So everything's been going really good. It's been a really great trip. London town and the Houses of Parliament are right here and Big Ben is right behind me and it's so pretty. I got up at 5 a.m. to do a, a morning show, um, performed What the Hell, and I'm doing a bunch of interviews now today all day. And then I'm going to do the Brit Awards tonight because uh, it just worked out perfectly that I was here. And um, so yeah, London. Did you get that? <laughs> she gets violent. WTH, I'm at the Brit Awards. I'm here in 
London promoting my record and the Brit Awards are happening, so I'm very honored to be here to be presenting an award tonight. Yeah, no, 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 give it away, give it away. For, uh, <laughs> I need the mix of you and me. Do <laughs> <laughs> you want a sneaky peek at who the winner is? Oh, yeah. You are, yeah. And at the end, when they finish, um, if you step back while I'm doing their passion, you can the play it. I don't know really what to say. I want to thank all my um, my fans over here. You guys are amazing, and fellow Canadian right here. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to say the name of the tour. Yeah. 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 Oh, I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> okay, so you guys have to let me know what you think, because I was thinking about calling this tour the Black Star Tour. <laughs> and the reason why I like the Black Star Tour is because then everybody can be my little black stars out in the audience. Whoa. <laughs> I know. What do you think? Black Star Tour? Okay, let's just do a show of hands here. If you want the Black Star Tour, <laughs> and who wants the Lullaby Tour? <laughs> okay, it's the Black Star Tour! Yeah. 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 more often. Aw, thank you. <laughs> and Boy George was very Whoa, to see that you, was really he? cool. He was standing right behind us and I was like, Is that who I think it is? That's really cool and I I decided to walk over. I'm a very shy person and say hello and I didn't know what he would do and he said Oh hi! And he knew who I was and I was like, Oh my god, of course he knows who you that are. Was cool. He was He was super nice. He to wants us. to get There's um, a lot of paparazzi here in London, and there's a lot of, of fans too, so what I just did was have my security guard go tell the fans to go step inside the lobby so I can sign properly for them and say hi, because the paparazzi are really aggressive here, and I don't want to miss anyone, but I'd also rather be able to take the time, the proper time, with the fans and not be rushed. So here we go, photo op. As my hair, as my neck. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 